Happening today, Boone County school leaders and MU faculty will sign a letter about plans to increase mental health services for local kids and families in public schools. In this morning's A Brighter Tomorrow, KOMU 8's Elise Schoenig in the newsroom to tell us how the services are going to work and why the outlets are necessary. Well, and normally kids can kind of just pack up whatever they need and take it with them to school. Signing this memo today, though, that's going to be something they can't exactly put in a backpack and bring with them. And that's going to be because this initiative is going to provide a lot of different outlets for students to be able to use in their own classroom spaces every day. And that includes anywhere from individual therapy sessions, group therapy sessions, crises management, and just about anything else an individual student may or may not need. I talked to one Rockbridge High School senior who's been really active in creating conversations surrounding mental health in his own high school. He's been creating Zoom meditations on the weekends for this entire year, and he told me that he hopes having resources like this more available throughout the county will help him and his classmates take self-care one step forward. And I think um, we tend to portray self-care as something that is um, of lower priority, meaning that only whenever you're in danger do you need care, um, and that's really not the case. And so um, I hope that through these resources that um, the district and that the university is providing, um, students will start to see that self-care is something that um, we all need. And there are, of course, a lot of other ways this will help the rest of our community. So if you want to check some of those out, you can head to our website at KOMU.com. That's under the A Brighter Tomorrow tab. Reporting in the newsroom, Elise Schoenig, KOMU 8 News.